Hello everyone, it's me, Shanaya, and welcome back to Shark Bite 2. In this video, we shall be reviewing the speedboat. You will find the speedboat in the boat builder, and it costs 14,000 shark feet. The speedboat has an average top speed of around 145, but can touch up to 155 max speed so when compared to fast boats like the jet ski and marlin the speedboat is in between both of them in terms of speed but the biggest advantage is that you can customize the boat with other assets while you cannot customize the jet ski and marlin so, let's look at the reasons to buy or not buy the speedboat. Reasons to buy It is fast and can outrun most of the sharks if driven properly. The speedboat can escape close encounters with the normal shark. outrun the hammerhead and orca. It is customizable with skins, extra seats and more. It can flip back easily if it gets overturned. It is fast even when you drive it backwards. Placing a turret on it makes it even more powerful. Reasons not to buy You can have only one turret on the speedboat. That means you can either place the double barrel turret or single turret. The short fin Mako can most probably outrun the speedboat as it is the fastest shark in the game. But for some reason they are rare to find. So overall from our experience the speedboat is worth buying. The boat is also easy to maneuver. So. Go for it if you are looking for a mid-sized customizable boat that can help you survive many rounds and give you the speed thrills. Please share your opinions in the comment section below. I hope you find this video helpful and don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel for more videos. See you guys next time.